Welcome everyone to this tutorial. Here is Stefano from Pictera and today I'm going to show you how you can connect the WMS server of Swisstopo to our platform. So first of all, let's create a project. I'll name it tutorial in this case. Once we are inside the project, we can uh, click here to add the imagery. In this case, we're going to online map imagery. Uh, we can select here Switzerland 25 centimeters and you'll see that immediately Switzerland map will load. In this case we are interested for the city of Zurich. We can zoom in and let's say we're happy with this region. So now at this point I can click on import visible region. Let's name it Zurich. Okay. And the region will be started to get uh, processed. After a few seconds, the um, region is imported into the platform and it's ready to be used. At this point, we can create a new detector. Um, let's go to vehicles. Tutorial vehicles, select training images, and at this point we can select our map. Next, here the a small uh, tutorial on the platform will be also shown. We don't want to check it out in this case, and we can start performing our annotations. In this case, I selected vehicles. So we can start working on the cars. However, let's say that we are not interested in this particular layer of Swiss topo, but we want something else to visualize. In this case, what we can do is, well, we travel back, go to the projects. We can create a new project or keep also the old one, tutorial two. Let's name it tutorial v2 in this case, but you can choose the name that suits most, suits the best your project. Online map imagery again, and now we will connect a new imagery server. So, but by going on this website, you will find the link below the video. You can copy the URL of Swiss Topo and put it here. WMS option is checked. Let's provide a name as well. Let's create a tutorial layer. Layer. And you'll see that several layers are available. In this case, yeah, you can explore them and choose whichever you prefer. In this case, I'll add a layer of Switzerland of 1946, which is this one, and I add it. At this point, I need also to add the resolution. We can again set it to 25 centimeters. As a last step, we confirm. Yeah, we travel a bit outside and the map, we actually found it here. Um, yeah, now let's go again uh, over to Rick. Yeah, let's zoom in. And again, we can import the visible region, call it whatever we prefer, Zurich 1946. The image again it will be processed. And when the image is imported, again, we can create a new detector or use the one of before. Let's modify the one of before. We can add here now also the Zurich 1946. And now in this case, we can develop the detector on this specific layer of Swiss Topo.